That's it. Keep moving. Howdy, partner. You come for a piece, haven't you? Welcome to New Vegas. Consider me your personal welcome wagon. Now hear this. The head honcho of New Vegas, Mr. House, is itching to make your acquaintance. Just head for the Lucky 38. It's the big old tower shaped like a roulette spinner. Yeah, partner. That's the spirit. He'll be waiting for you. Well, howdy, partner. Good to see you again. Boss is waiting for you upstairs, so get a move on. Come back soon now. Where to, partner? Penthouse floor. Your move, Green. This meeting has been a long time coming, hasn't it? You've come a long ways, literally, and I suspect, figuratively as well. I have to ask, now that you've reached your destination, what do you make of what you see? Of course you haven't. Vegas always was one of a kind. What you see down on the Strip is just a fraction of the city's former glory, and yet, more than an echo, I preserved its spirit. Or perhaps you were referring to the Lucky 38? The years haven't been kind to her. But still, she manages to impress. Oh, don't be coy. You've been playing a high-stakes game ever since Victor dug you out of the ground. Don't be afraid to admit it. The business is this. One of my employees has stolen an item of extraordinary value from me. And I want it recovered. Simple enough. My only concern is the recovery of the platinum chip. What happens to Benny, I leave to your discretion. When you bring the chip to me, I will pay you four times the delivery bonus stipulated in your contract. How's that? Well enough. Return to me when you have the platinum chip in your possession. Any final matters for us to discuss? What? It won't be easy. Benny is always surrounded by at least four bodyguards, except when he's in his private suite on the 13th floor of the Tops. It's more complicated than that. The chairmen share what you might call a 
tribal affinity. Look for a man named Swank, Benny's second in command. He's always been a reliable, if unimaginative, employee. Do your best to convince him that you're working under my auspices. If you have evidence of Benny's crimes, show it to him. Sneaking into Benny's suite on the 13th floor would be very difficult, but not impossible. There might be guards. Certainly there'd be a sturdy lock on his front door. I am Robert Edwin House, President, CEO, and sole proprietor of the New Vegas Strip. I oversaw the city's renovations starting from 2274 onward. The three families are my employees. Before the Great War of 2077, I was the founder, president, and CEO of Robco Industries, a vast computer and robotics corporation. Don't let the video screens and computer terminals fool you. I'm flesh and blood, not silicon. Let's just say it was very... costly. We can discuss this in... I recruited a tribal force to supplement my Securitrons and renovated the Strip just in time to welcome the NCR as it marched into the region. Instead of war, a treaty was negotiated and the money started to pour in. Congratulations, partner. The boss has instructed me to comp you to the high roller suite. You can bring your friends too. Be like a little clubhouse for the gang you put together. Just bear in mind, you're the only one gets to see the boss. Any friends you got, they can wait in the suite. Enjoy the digs, partner. They're plenty fancy. Hey, hey, fellow, welcome to the Tops Hotel and Casino. I'm gonna have to ask you to hand over any weapons you might be carrying. Security, baby. Can't make the bread if the bakers are full of lead. You dig it? Don't worry, you're safe as houses in here. Courtesy of Mr. House. Smooth and easy. Oh, and a friendly word of advice. If you happen to stumble across any weapons during your stay here, well, just don't wear them openly. You dig? Now that we got that little business out of the way, what can I do to make your tops experience the tops? What in the goddamn? Let's keep this in the groove, hey? Smooth moves, smooth. Hello! The guy everyone saw go in the Lucky 38, that was you? Oh, shit. I hit what I was aiming for. Guess you had brains to spare. Or you just thick-skulled. Either way, baby, this is good news. Maybe I can finally sleep at night, knowing you didn't die. What say you and me cash out? Go somewhere it's more private-like. Any questions you got, I'll answer.
To start, I'll comp you the presidential. Best suite in the house. You deserve a taste of the VIP lifestyle. I'll hang out down here for a while to make everything look business as usual, then come to you. Any questions you got, I'll answer. Guaranteed. If that's what it takes to win your trust, that's what it takes. Follow me. Hello. Now that you and me's got some privacy, I gotta ask, how is it that you're still living? Yeah, hello. Well, serves me right for using a 9mm. Once you were vertical, how'd you track me down? Yeah, that's... I guess that's enough scratching around at first base. Tell me, which way is the wind gonna blow? You've got a crazy drop on me here, baby. That's for sure. If killing's what you came... But baby, you'd be disappointing me. All the trouble you went through to arrange this shindig must be something more you're after. Then this is Ensville, baby. May the best man win. He admires your accomplishment, your crimes against the Legion, including the death of the fearless Wulpes in Kultar. My lord requires your pre- The mighty Kaisar has bestowed upon you his mark and guarantee- Seek Kaisar by- What is it? It's the Hover. So, Benny has been- handled, and you've recovered the platinum chip. Let's have it. Such a small thing, isn't it? And yet so capacious, so very dear. Decades of hiring salvagers out west to search for this little relic in the ruins of a place called Sunnyvale. Back then, anyway. That's where the chip was printed. On October 22nd, 2077, it was to have been hand-delivered to me here at the Lucky 38 the next day. But the bombs fell first. Suffice it to say, the delivery was never made. Things are more easily shown than told. Take the elevator all the way down to the bottom level, and you'll see what I mean. Don't worry, you'll like what you see. We have much to accomplish, you and I. Step closer to the demonstration area, if you would. I expect you're well familiar with my Securitrons by now. The titanium alloy housing that protects its electronic core deflects small arms and shrapnel easily enough. Its X-25 Gatling laser, produced to spec by Glastic House is deadly against soft targets at medium range. And for close range suppression or crowd control, the Securitron is armed with a 9mm submachine gun. All of this you probably already knew. What you did not know is that these are the Securitron's secondary weapons. All this time, my Securitrons have had to get by running the Mark I operating... 
lack software drivers for their primary weapons. Today, with the delivery of the Platinum Chip, all that changes. Behold, for the first time, Securitrons running the Mark II OS. The M235 missile launcher gives the Securitron the ability to engage ground at significantly longer ranges. And a rapid-fire G28 grenade launcher ensures the Securitron is deadly in close-range engagements. The software upgrade also includes drivers for the Securitron's highly sophisticated onboard auto repair systems. Altogether, the Mark II software upgrade confers a 235% increase in combat effectiveness per unit. The city of New Vegas finally has soldiers worthy of protecting it. Return to the penthouse now. We have much to discuss. Trips to the basement are rarely so educational, don't you think? I've since broadcast the upgrade to every Securitron in range of my transmitters, and I must say, it's causing quite a stir down on the strip. I'm surprised you can still underestimate me after everything you've seen. I haven't shown my hand. I've shown one card. I've given my enemies a single provocative datum upon which to fixate. They have no idea what other cards I'm holding. It's a strong hand, believe me. I dealt it to myself. To secure the future of New Vegas, I must have your assistance. The work ahead is dangerous, but you weather danger well. The next step will require you to infiltrate Caesar's camp at Fortification Hill. Absolutely not. Caesar is of great use to me. I don't want you harming a hair on that man's head, assuming you could find one. I'm not surprised. The Legion has spies on the Strip. I want you to open a hatch in the basement of the derelict weather station atop Fortification Hill. You'll recognize it on sight. The hatch bears the logo of the Lucky 38, same as the Platinum Chip. You can't, but the chip can. The hatch will recognize the Platinum Chip and open sesame. I'm not offering you an incentive as crude as money, though there'll be plenty of that. What I'm offering you is a ground floor opportunity in the most important enterprise on Earth. What I'm offering is a future. For you, and for what remains of the human race. Here, take the platinum chip again. You will need it. Upon arrival at the fort, it's likely that you'll be searched and the chip taken from you. Don't worry, it will come back to you. Where to, partner? Casino floor, 